Hi everyone. Now we're going to move on to the second of our cyanotype experiments. This time we're going to be using the same chemistry to look at the effectiveness of sunscreens. Prior to where this video starts, I've prepared the solutions. I added 40 millilitres of water to each of the bottles and have shaken to dissolve the iron nitrate and ethane dioic acid. And I also added two cubic centimetres of water to the potassium hexacyanoferrate in the bijou and shaken to dissolve as well. To prepare the reagent itself, you add one millilitre of potassium hexacyanoferrate 3 to the ethane dioic acid solution. Now I'm putting some aluminium foil around the bottle to keep any stray light out. You can actually do this at any time, but I'd forgotten. Now pour your iron nitrate into the first bottle and give it a little swirl to mix. In this case I'm just using two petri dishes as a demonstration. You were sent four if you need, but you will need at least two, one as a control. You can also see that I've wrapped the bases of my petri dishes in aluminium foil to prevent any light coming in at the side. This improves results, but is not essential. Now you need to apply your sunscreen, or sunscreens, to the lids of all bar one of the petri dishes, keeping one as a control. The easiest way is probably to smear it over with a cotton wool bud, but you can do it however you like. There is also an interesting discussion that can be had about this with your pupils, about how best to make this a fair test. Once you have the lids coated, Pour a small amount of solution into each of your petri dish bases. The 80 millilitres you have allows for 20 in each, which is enough. For the moment you can just do it by eye, as long as they're roughly the same all will be well. A quick swirl will get it spread evenly over the base. Now put the lids on and set about exposing them to the UV light. If you don't have access to a UV lamp, just place them on a bright windowsill. It may take longer, but it will certainly work. If you do have a lamp, like this one here perhaps, then try to ensure that all the dishes get roughly the same exposure. You can see I'm moving the lamp about over the dishes, keeping it at the same height as far as I can. Within a few seconds, you should see that the control is starting to go significantly bluer in colour. As time goes on, the blue gets darker. It's a little harder to see the one with the sunscreen in, as the sunscreen itself is obscuring it, but it clearly looks much more yellow. Once finished, you can simply compare the colours. You can either look qualitatively, or if you have the time and the apparatus, you can use colorimeter to get some more quantitative values. If you place a cover or just some foil over the dishes, that will prevent any further colour change while you're getting things ready. 